Jonathan Fungi. I uh, hope you're doing well and welcome to Lido's Musings. Uh, today I'm going to read for you a poem uh, called Nostalgia and it's about my um, life uh, which started uh, in Iran and um, our transition, our coming, uh, leaving Iran um, due to the uh, Islamic revolution that happened and put the Baha'is in more danger um, as a result. Uh, the prejudice against Baha'is has been instigated by the Muslim clergy since its inception and now it's at um, quite a, a difficult level actually and uh, so I um, dedicate this poem to all people who are yearning for freedom, freedom of religion, freedom of thought, freedom of speech. The scent of saffron and rose water reminds me of my Persian past. The busy streets of the bazaar, the veil clad ladies bargaining for the best price. The tree-lined streets of Shiraz, the entrance gate, Darwaze Quran, the garden of our house where the weeping willows swayed in the wind, the large dining room where many a guest dined. The American school I went to where East met West, and my heart was one, where the language and culture of the West opened my eyes to another reality in a land far off where I experienced the richness of diversity and a door was opened that could not be shut. And so it was that gradually there grew a yearning in my heart to know those lands to experience freedom. Freedom from religious prejudice, freedom of thought, freedom to express myself and not be afraid to talk. Many days have passed since those days in Iran. I have called many City's home, I have laughed, I have cried. I have experienced the freedom I longed for, but as I think of my sisters and brothers in Tehran and Shiraz, I hope that they too will soon taste the sweet savor of freedom. Wishing you a lovely day.